Today we will learn the addition of rational numbers and additive inverse. Suppose we represent the distance measured in the right direction by the plus sign and the distance measured in the left direction with the minus sign. Now imagine if a car travels in a distance of 9 by 4 km in the right direction and then turns a distance of 3 by 4 km in the left direction, how can the distance from the initial position to the final position be obtained? Think? Absolutely right. Here we have to sum the distances covered in both the cases. In mathematics, we will denote this by 9 by 4 plus minus 3 by 4. Here, the distance of 9 by 4 km is fixed in the right direction, so it is denoted by positive rational number. While the distance of 3 by 4 km is fixed in the left direction, so it is called negative rational number. Let us find the result of the sum of these rational numbers on the number line. First of all, we will draw a number line assuming 1 km distance as a unit and mark the integers with 0 on it. Now we see that the denominator of both rational numbers is 4. The number written in place of the denominator tells how many equal parts of the unit have been made such that the number written in place of the denominator year 4 tells us that each unit is divided into 4 equal distances. So we will make 4 equal parts of each unit distance of the number line. Now we can mark 1 by 4, 2 by 4, 3 by 4 to the right of 0, thus rational numbers. Similarly, to the left of 0, we can write rational numbers minus 1 by 4, minus 2 by 4, minus 3 by 4. Now, let us sum the given numbers. Here, the first number is 9 by 4. So, we will find the place 9 by 4. 9 by 4 is a positive rational number. So, its position is 9 steps to the right of 0. Now, we will look at the second number. If the second number is positive, we move to the right. But, if it is negative, we move to the left. Like, minus 3 by 4 here is a negative rational number. Being negative, we will now work 3 steps to the left of 9 by 4 on the number line. With this, we will reach the number 6 by 4. Therefore, 9 by 4 plus minus 3 by 4 is equal to 6 by 4. Imagine if we had to add these rational numbers without the number line. How would we do this? Absolutely right. Their sum is done in the same way as the sum of fractions, but while doing this, we need to take care of the signs. Like here, we see that denominator of the two rational numbers is the same, so we will keep it same for every result and add the numerators of both rational numbers to find the result of the fraction. Here 9 plus minus 3 is equal to 6, so we get the result 6 by 4 and it is a positive rational number. Using this technique, we can say that the car is 6 by 4 km to the right from its starting point. If the car travelled 9 by 4 km in the right direction and then 7 by 2 km in the left direction, how far would it have been from the starting point? Think about it. Here also, we have to add distances in both cases, which will express by this operation 9 by 4 plus minus 7 by 2. Now we will be able to add these two rational numbers only when each of their denominator is equal. To make the denominator equal, we find the LCM of the denominators of both rational numbers. We will receive here LCM of 4 and 2 is 4. Denominator of 9 by 4 is already 4, so we will not make any change in it. But it is not 4 in the case of minus 7 by 2. To do so, we multiply the numerator minus 7 by 2 by 2 and denominator by 2. This will give us the rational number minus 14 by 4. Here we are getting 4 as well as the value of the rational number is not changing because both the numerator and denominator of minus 7 by 2 is multiplied by the same number. Now we can add them. Here we will write the same common denominator of the 2 in the result and sum the numerators to get the numerator 9 plus minus 14 is equal to minus 5. Thus, the result of the sum of the numbers given is minus 5 by 4. When we talk about the sum of rational numbers, another important situation comes out here. This means that the final position of the car will be at a distance of 5 by 4 km left of the initial position. 
Suppose a car starts from its starting point and runs for a distance of 9 by 4 km to the right and then moves the same distance to the left, then it will reach which place? Think about it. Exactly, the car will again reach its starting point. That is, 9 by 4 plus minus 9 by 4 is equal to 0. Thus, if the sum of any two rational numbers is 0, they are called additive inverse of each other. If we look at the location of 9 by 4 and the location of minus 9 by 4 from 0, they are equally spaced in opposite directions. Therefore, we can also say that if any two rational numbers with respect to 0 are equally spaced in opposite directions, they are called additive inverse of each other. The additive inverse of a rational number is obtained by changing its sign. So now you must have understood the additive inverse. Thus, today we learned addition and additive inverse of rational numbers. In the next video, we will get to know them better by some examples.